We'd replace the lower end of the thigh bone with a metal component that's usually made of cobalt chrome, it's an alloy. There is a small amount of nickel in these, so some people are metal sensitive and, and can't have that, but that's very rare. We used to do patch testing, so you'd give you little patches on your skin to see if you're allergic, but that doesn't correlate with the allergy inside. But, but there are some people who can't wear any metal jewellery, so they might not be appropriate, and we'd have to use a different metal here. But that's rare, so most people are fine, cobalt and chrome. Then on the top of the tibia, the shin bone, we, we, we take the top of the bone off and we put a metal tray. In most cases, that's made out of titanium. And people always think all joints are made of titanium. That's fine in certain instances. It's no good as a bearing surface where it's going to be rubbed because it's too soft a metal. And then between the titanium tray and the cobalt chrome femur, we put plastic. That's a special form of polyethylene, which is engineered and produced to last longer than it used to. Um, and that's the weak link in the chain because that will wear out over time, slowly.